It was two months ago, and I was with my sisters, Carrie and Heather, and they asked, so how's everything going for the wedding? And I said, it's going great. Uh, Catherine had this planned when she was 10 years old. <laughs> so they're like, no, no, how's your, how's your father of the bride toast coming along? And so I said, well, I hadn't started yet. And they said, well, you know, what you might consider doing is talking to you, you know, mom and dad who've been married for over 55 years. They might have some good content for you. So I said, great, that's a good idea. So I talked to my parents and I just want to share, you know, a few nuggets about, um, you know, a successful marriage and what goes into that. So first and foremost, you know, outside of your faith and your health, there's nothing more important than family and friends. And when I look across here, how awesome are these family and friends? Then they said for a strong marriage, there's really three C's that you have to think about. Um, first, you have to have this commitment to each other. You have to have open communication. Go on, shoot. Okay, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah. Oh. So I have to read first? Okay. And you have to compromise because you're not gonna agree on everything. And my dad also said that you have to have plenty of beer in the fridge and not that bush light stuff, a real IPA. <laughs> like said beer. Um, you gotta have each other's back and you have to subtly take care of each other. And, you know, you can't sweat the small stuff. Thank you. Thanks for letting me. I'm so glad you're here. We picked this dress out. Yes, we did. It's perfect. I love it. Love you, Dan. He's too sweet. Catherine, <laughs> you're not everything to me. No matter what is going on, or whatever happens in life, you are it. <laughs> From awkwardly meeting <laughs> at a friend's 4th of July party, <laughs> and now being here this moment, prepared to take vows that will further our love for each other. It's one of the craziest <laughs> and most exciting rides I've ever had the, the pleasure of being a part of. My love, I cannot believe today is here. I get to marry my best friend in the entire world today. You have been my person for quite some time, but I'm beyond excited to make it official in front of all of our friends and family. I truly believe our souls were meant for each other. You make things make sense for me. You level me out when I'm escalated. <laughs> I've never known <laughs> I've never known a person that sees me with the eyes that you see me. I cannot thank you enough for having made me a better person, a better friend, a better lover. <laughs> you look so nice. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> you. Oh, you. <laughs> I have a little tissue in my flowers. <laughs> See? <laughs> You're so cute. I love you. <laughs> <laughs>
cada credit. Yes. Thank you. We're good. Thank you. <laughs> You're very nice. Today and every day moving forward, I promise to put our relationship first. I promise to be your partner in this life, no matter what is thrown at us. I promise to brag about you, be proud of who you are, and fight for you. I promise to be your biggest cheerleader and push you towards your goals. I love you forever and ever. Catherine Ann Martin, almost Wilkerson. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please rise. I, Michael, take you, Catherine, to be my wife, to have and to hold till this day forward, in sickness and in health, better for worse, richer for poor, to love and to cherish, to do us part. I, Catherine, take you, Michael to be my husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish till death do us part. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now seal this ceremony with a kiss. It's my privilege to announce for the first time the new Mr. and Mrs. Wilkerson. I need everybody to please stand. It is absolutely my pleasure to announce for only the second time, Mr. and Mrs. Wilkinson. <laughs> you look great. What a perfect match these two are for each other, both dedicated and always present, not only for each other, but for their friends and their family. I feel truly blessed to have been a part of their journey so far, knowing that it is only just beginning. So if you guys would all raise a glass with me to Michael and Catherine. Here. here. Hello, hello. How are we feeling tonight, everybody? I've had the pleasure of getting to know Michael more and more. He is loyal, trustworthy. Calming influence in Catherine's life and always down for a good time. He's taken my brother under his wing, thank God. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's awesome, you kid, fantastic. So I would like to propose a toast to much love and happiness in those three C's to Catherine and Michael. Cheers. Cheers.